Fucking biggest motherfucker I've ever seen. Four eyes. Even though we all have glasses. Yeah, we all wear, we all wear glasses, but he's definitely four eyes. Uh, what's up, guys? Uh, it's fucking Grand Finals Game 1. Uh, I think the end of their set in Winner's Finals was Vrail three-stocking him. So... <laughs> I don't. He did three stock. I don't think it was the last set. I, or the last game. I don't. It might not have been the last game, but I know there I was think, a three stock yeah, in there. It, somewhere. I think it was actually game two because Brody won and Bro just clapped back. Oh yeah. Well, you know, like both of these players are very good, but Pichu is like, like playing Pichu and then being good is like such a <laughs> like bonus. Pichu is nuts, dude. Like that's not to say that Brody can't do it. Like Roy's also. Very I think good. Brody can do it. He just has to make the adjustments. Yeah, definitely. There's just. Like, I know when they last set, there were just a couple of times where, like, he would get stocks. That was good. Yeah, like, that was a really good uh, call out on his attempt to air dodge back. Like, like, Roy can definitely, like, scrap with Pichu. Uh, he has the frame data for it. Uh, and since his sweet spot is up close, he can definitely. Oh! Um, but, you know, scrapping doesn't mean shit uh, if Pichu's daring you at, like, 60. <laughs> Why is uh, Pichu so strong, dude? Uh, dude, he can't control his power. <laughs> <laughs> He's just trying to evolve. <laughs> yeah, like when he turns into P. But like he, has, he doesn't have max attack. Okay, he's just rage. If and you're envy. In, if you're in the same game as the evolved form of yourself, right? <laughs> and you're higher on the tier list. Do you want to evolve? No. I don't think so. You don't want to be like him. Definitely not. Uh, I think that's what it is, though. Like Pichu is evolved from max happiness. This Pichu is just like he's a level 100 Pichu, but he's pissed, dude. He's pissed off. He's so, just filled with rage and despair. He's angry. But, like, it's... <laughs> tired not, of being cut from melee. <laughs> <laughs> I think probably the biggest thing that Brody needs to work on is how he deals with um, Thunder Jolt. Yeah. Because, like, he was keeping it relatively close and even had a lead at one point. But, like, oh, a, Braille is just so good at... Yeah. He throws the dungeon jewel, he does the short hop, so it has no lag, and he can just follow behind it. He gets that free, like, 12% projectile. Reacts to how Brody tries to yeah. the dodge. Yeah. That was close. Now, I don't know how Roy would deal with it. Maybe try jabbing it, but, like, other than that, I don't know. I have no idea. Like, counter he, it. Yeah, counter it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that would work maybe, like, one time. Yeah. <laughs> before he just starts throwing it and then waiting for the counter. Uh, so, like, Grail's gonna take that game one. It wasn't a blowout by any means. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think... Uh, are we gonna see Krom? Oh! Krom, okay. Interesting. I, I like do it. think... You don't play Krom? It's the same thing as Roy, except now, now you can air it. Now you can, like, attack him. You don't have to try to space anything. But uh, now I'm back to say it's gonna right, be hard. So he's prom. So at this point, I'm convinced Brody's just giving up. Uh, not like I kind of respect it. Like just trying something new. Yeah, definitely. And uh, you can always go back to Roy for game three. Yeah, yeah, de definitely. Look at that. Look at that. He did it right there. He wasn't even off stage. <laughs> Uh, no, that is a good move, though, for when Pichu touches your shield, which I, Roy really can't punish that often. Uh, and a lot of his aerials will just kill outright, as opposed to... Living? Yeah. Yeah, uh, like, Rail's gonna have to parry those if he wants to punish it. But the FTL's gonna take it. Uh, he, right now, like... Is Chrome any stronger than Roy? Uh, he's not... Okay, his sword overall is stronger than his sour spot, okay. but Roy's sweet spot is strong. Okay. Um, so, like... I think the big thing with 
Tom to recover, right, is you have to save your air dodge. Yeah, that would be creative with it. He has a lot of air grip. But we were kind of talking about in the last map, Rel's really good at uh, punishing air dodge. Right? Yeah. They're both actually, like, they are, really yeah. solid at it. Okay, the, really the two frame with the F tilt. See, he couldn't have done that with Roy. Hmm. You know, from a whole lot of prom shit. Uh, but, uh, so, he lost. Oh! Oh, oh my! <laughs> Good Maybe that, that's definitely got to be something that he was thinking about when he was like, I don't even play this character, but like... <laughs> F2 of the No, like the really unfortunate thing about Crom's recovery is that he only has super armor at the start. Yeah. So like that entire, and that entire he's time he's brought right, up, dude. he has no hitbox. Like, he's not even going to trade. Dude, the saddest thing is when... He's dead. <laughs> he got that two frame. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, it, like if you play Roy, you can play Kron. It's a little awkward. Uh, wow. <laughs> you know, Brody making it work. Yeah. You know, he's just saying, like, I just want these outright kills. Like, Roy's going to be winning the kill right there. The F Toe the kill. And he definitely wouldn't have killed him at zero with that up B if he was. Oh, yeah. Um, character is cheese. He's completely different up B, right? Character is not real. Kron is not a real player. <laughs> the up beat definitely felt real. <laughs> tied in zero. Um, it happens. Um, I wonder if Brian's thinking, I want to say Tom, or if he's like, I kind of got lucky maybe in any of those spots. Uh, I'd like to think that the way that he's going to approach this is I literally have nothing to lose from trying to win with Tom. True. Uh, because his Roy wasn't gonna, it wasn't cutting it out really. This shit is crazy. I'm not gonna lie. He literally said to us before that game, I've never played Prom before in my life. <laughs> Do you think, you think that it was intentional to upbeat Spike or was he just Definitely not. He was just trying to recover. But, but, uh, like, but I mean, that's if, the beauty if that of, happens, yeah. yeah. Like, that's the beauty of characters like Prom and Ike. It's like, when that happens, you know, we take those. We definitely take those. He was definitely down that whole game. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, and then he came back and then he killed him at 60 with the news review. Man. Oh boy, dude, Krom. Like, not having to worry about the sour spots to kill and get your damage is like, so. so much of like, a boom. Alright. But, like, how is Rail gonna respond? Obviously, that, yeah. like, he. Not a single time during that game was he playing bad per se, no. but like Brody, like he caught him off guard by killing him at zero. I think a lot of it had to do with uh, like Krom is an Echo Fighter, boy, so I'm gonna keep playing how it was. But yeah, and he's then not, these he's things not, caught him off guard. It's not really yet yeah, like that. Yeah. He kind of he tried to recover onto the stage. Well, I think maybe he just missed the ledge, but you know, F tilt, he's gonna take it. It's not like Krom, uh, Roy will like. He would have had to wait for him to get a little bit closer and potentially win. He could just outright do it. Like, Krom is actually really, like, kind of stupid. I actually like Krom more than really. Like, I play Krom a little bit, but I don't know, like, any knowledge about him. It's like one of those characters you play in print games where you're like, you like, play yeah, this I'm mashing buttons, yeah. but it's, it's cool. Yeah, it's whenever I don't want to think like anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I don't yeah, know how I feel about that recovery. He uh, used his air dodge really. He really. jumped before he yeah. used his air dodge too. So like the air dodge itself, oh, sure he could have got hit, but then he could have made it back if he saw his jump. Uh, of course, for the next couple stops, he's probably gonna remember that, assuming he doesn't get like dared. That was a lot know. of damage. Damn it, real. He's got the peachy knowledge. He's got the strats. He knows what he's doing. Uh, he's getting his damage in. He's doing, like he's just doing his Pichu BMBs. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen him do a lightning loop, but it has not mattered. Uh, he definitely is like good at the combos. I, yeah, I, all of the day I haven't really seen him do any loops or anything like that. Yeah, but like the, but his combos are insane. Yeah, definitely. And it's really like it's telling that like Pichu's broken um, when you see that he air dodges into the ledge and the F smash two frames him, and the F tilt can also two frame him. Yeah. Uh, because Pichu has very big hitboxes despite the size. Also, his ears are not hip, like they're not hurtboxes. He just has the tangible ears. Bro, those ears are made of steel. <laughs> well, okay, so we were playing dubs, right? I was playing Ness. I got a PK Thunder 2, and he beat it with his name. <laughs> <laughs> Cause it's, yeah, because yeah, he spins his ears around. 
Let us know. <laughs> like, this is actually kind of crazy how, like, bro, he is. Yeah, it's super close considering uh, the sudden rapid change to Kron. But, okay. He's not actually even going to be able to get a good enough punish. And I think that's one of the things where Pichu really shines, well, uh, not shines, uh, does not shine, is that, you know, since he's so small, he can't cover a lot of distance. Uh, so he went to that top platform was completely safe. Okay, jab back air. Brody's really good with that with Roy. And the timing is literally the exact same with Krom. Okay. So, yeah. I think if he does it again, he'll pop. The, uh, oh, well, I didn't. I thought he, I thought bro up smash. <laughs> no, he, uh, he definitely cut that back air. He, it starts behind him because yeah, that's nuts. Yeah, man. Uh, look, Crom's working out. Look, top tier shit. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I thought I literally thought bro hit Brody that last. Week. <laughs> oh no, it's uh. Very rarely. And I think what the hell? this is definitely working out <laughs> for Brody. I saw uh, Brody play Sheik over there. Yeah, he was definitely practicing her. Uh, this was his main in Smash 4. Oh, cool. And did he just play all the crazy? We got it. and Sheik. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, waiting, I'm waiting on his Joker, to be honest. Actually, I, I think. No, that was probably not my Joker. I don't doubt that Rose Joker would be sick. <laughs> The Sheik pick from Braille, uh, like damage wise, not that bad. Uh, if he can just like actually get the situations that he's wanting uh, from Brody off stage. Did she get buffed in the Yes, yeah. yes she did. They made her fair bigger. Okay, cool. So now you can actually use it. <laughs> uh, sometimes it would just randomly whip. Uh, also, needles charge faster. Is it still a charge for her to kill? Um, not necessarily uh i mean i guess that's it's still hard for her to kill but it's a lot easier now uh, that was good over the course of the couple of patches they buffed her up smash uh her down to tippers easily or more easily uh, so that it can combo into up smash okay more often uh needles making them charge faster easier to set up for off stage uh needles bouncing fish uh -huh. etc and then like just the fair buff in general She's putting out more damage, she's getting more stage control, she's doing her shit, you know. But he, and like, he actually has the lead right now. Like, he's doing, I don't want to say as good as his Pichu was, but he's not getting watched. No, yeah. Like, it definitely was, it was worth the counterfeit. But I don't have any That was a good grab from Braille. Uh, didn't really get anything off of it. Uh, he tried to read the DI, but I think he just went the wrong way with it. Okay, trapping the landing. Oh, wow. That was a, definitely a bad down smash. Uh, he was expecting the tech roll in. Or not tech roll in, but just roll in. Uh, oh, oh, I like that. That down beat, right? He's fine, he's fine. He's, he's back. He's back. Alright, uh, so I think if Rail were to try to slow the game down, start charging his needles more, um, start, you know, making Brody come in. His personal experience with Brody, I think that's the scariest part about playing him. Is on on He's yeah. so good at that. Yeah, when I was playing him in uh, Loser's Finals, like, I can just feel like the pressure of he knows what he's gonna do. Yeah. But there you go. Like the no hitbox when he's rising, so he's all just her box. So you can just smack him. You do have to kind of time it right, but you know obviously Barrel has that down. Yeah. Oh, jab, jab. Wow. I wish I had a promise. Has all the games been like that? Yeah. Like Brody's been keeping it close, and like he's up right now. He's just two, two, one, I believe. Okay, an air F smash, you know, damage wise, keeping it up. Uh, he really hasn't gotten any of those end guards he's been looking for. Up the out shield there. That's the it's a good unexpected. He does like he does a lot of 8%. Like he takes he was at like 80 
Oh. He charges just a bit too long. Okay, yeah. Alright. Oh, he's got it. Yeah. Caught him pressing the button. Real Spacing was really on point. Oh yeah, he, he was definitely catching and moving out of shield, getting him to whip on it, like getting him to whip moves. And then at the ledge, you know, I think he was expecting him to go in, and that's why he fared. Mm -hmm. uh, that bounce of fish instead. Now we are game five, set one, grand finals. Rel versus Rel is his to, is Rel his tag one game name is Brody or is that his name? His tag is Brody. <laughs> Brody. His, name his name is Brody. Is Brody. Yeah. Okay. Um. So this is. You know, for real, he just needs one more game. Yeah. Wins the tournament. Brody, he just needs one more game. Reset bracket. It could go either way, honestly. Like, the way that they've both been adapting to each other and both picking their, like, the character picks. Um, so Brody thinking. It, yeah, back to Roy. Definitely something that I could have seen happening. Yeah. Uh, but now, he is going to kill Sheik. At like 50, and he doesn't have to worry about potentially getting edge guards. Yes. So we're probably gonna see a set too. Like, obviously, I don't want to speak uh, like too soon, mm -hmm. but you never know. Yeah. I don't know though. Braille's keeping up damage wise. It was a really good bread and butter combo. He's got the nice extension. Get the damage. <laughs> I like the crawl. Really glad to be seeing like she's out here. You know, like even if he doesn't win the set, you know, the fact that he even took a game yeah. with like the character that I'm, I'm sure he would consider like a pocket. But then again, Gordy literally like was like I'll play Bronco. That's true. <laughs> Which, I mean, to a certain extent, he, oh wow, he got hit by like, yeah, that, that very last hit of side B. Like Dude, said, okay, so people s people like to like meme and say that Roy is not very good. Uh, that side B will kill you at 80. This side B is ridiculous, <laughs> dude. It kills you so early. It's so strong. Apparently, it's like stronger than Limit Cross Smash. Yes, it's yes. def it's definitely stronger than Limit Cross Smash. Nuts. <laughs> uh, maybe not at like the later later percents, but like it'll kill you at like 80. Limit Cross Smash will not do that. <laughs> oh, that was that was a really good effort. I don't think he was expecting. Uh, let's go. I don't think he was expecting him to uh, up air again. Put it in my back pocket. <laughs> Look, I'm just trying to get closer. To this. Oh, whoa. Well, well, you know, guess we gotta pay out to the crowd, you know, because we're all winners at the end of the day. We are, except for me, because I went out and I love you. To be fair, to be fair, I've told everybody this. The that stream you, is probably very tired of me saying it. I had to play W for trying to lose. Oh, man. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh my god, all P this damage PR. coming out. Yeah, a PR And player. I'm Rick, so... <laughs> you know, we're all dealing with what we got. <laughs> uh, this is where Sheik starts to shine. He's up a stock. The Sour Spots do enough damage, and Sweet Spots will probably start outright killing me very soon. And Sheik is like, how do I get the kill? He's not gonna be falling into my stuff. And he hits... The Shin Shoryu you can <laughs> Dragon Punch DP Inferno to Inferno Divider. Racket oh yeah. God. Forty has <laughs> reset. <laughs> Forty has reset bracket. Oh, uh, uh W. What? Hell yeah, that's some gas money. I'll take it. Dude. Oh, is that the devil's money? I thought that was your single. Oh, that was my single's money. I paid. Oh, gas for, money. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I thought I'm you were just like. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you trying to get any more out? Or? Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. Of course. All right, so like, Braille, you know, he's switching back to Pichu, you know, Pichu Chrome, uh, set two now. Already got the reset, and a kind of dominant game five, honestly. It kind of just felt like they were just playing as a formality. Um, can Braille do this? Uh, 
he really just has to adapt to the space in the game. Like, he's I, still playing like it's Roy. I mean, even he says that Roy wants to really think that Roy wants to do it. Yeah, he's this is for Pichu. Yeah. I, I, I see it. I bet it's working too. It did it work. Did. Yeah. He reset bracket. <laughs> oh my god. Dean <laughs> Sin literally says, I've yeah. never played this character before. <laughs> <laughs> Games 2 and 3. <laughs> it's very wild. I guess if you're gonna die anyway, right? Like, yeah. you're gonna get killed your off stage regardless of your point. Okay. What happened? What happened was he lost game one with Roy, won two games with Prom. Lost game four with Prom. Yeah, I bet Gomez late running himself right. He loves Prom. Yeah, like Prom's Dude, like. I don't wait for Prom to start coming. Or not Prom. Uh, Gomez to start coming back. Yeah, like Prom's basic like B and B combos do enough damage that like. And with Bordy's like good edge ledge trapping, with Crom's like F tilt back kills at 80. Yeah, he's he's, he's, he's getting moves. way more like two frames and stuff with Crom, dude. But Braille, Braille is doing really good with punishing Crom. Oh yeah, like he's gotta be. Feeling oh, I like that. I really like that. He's gotta be feeling like I can do this. It's like. It just, it really sucks when you're a character without a sword versus a really good character with a sword. And like you saw, he tried to nair. Like, even with how good his nair is, it didn't matter because he got back aired by a sword. Also, though, on the flip side, it really sucks when you're like a crackhead mouse. And you're <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. When you're just some guy. You're just some guy with a sword and an electric mouse starts attacking you. Like, he got that down smash uh, out of shield, catching him hitting his shield. It's pretty Good. Okay. Nair into down tilt, up tilt, uh, fair, 36%. Uh, this is bad. I was gonna say, like, this is where, like, Braille doesn't want to get caught moving, um, out of shield defensively, otherwise he's gonna eat a move that will kill him from across the stage on the biggest stage of the game. God, that took a lot of damage. Yes. <laughs> Calm? People sleep on Calm, and, you know, like, Vordy does not play this character. <laughs> yes, guys. He, he plays Roy <laughs> too. He plays the archetype and he plays the character in the for Chrome. Yeah. Are you in the Chrome Discord? No. Isn't the Chrome in the Roy Discord? Is he dead? He died. So. Wow. Is that just not so the guy? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I like having kind of you off. here whenever I'm commentating because I was asking all these questions. I can be like, is that what happened to you? And you're like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 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 literally, yeah, like, it got to the point where I was like, okay, am I gonna roll, am I gonna jump and pray, just don't, as long as you don't move to get it, that's the easiest thing to react to, just move to get it, because, because he is, he, 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 he is Trom, and he will F tilt you, and he will die. What's that tattoo? Uh, that is the mark of his country. It's not, well, I bet it's a wash off so, it, that's how you, Temporary. Yes. Royalty, yes. All the, the people of the line of that family have that tattoo. Lucina has it too. It's I bet her, they're all temporary. It's in her eye. No. Lucina's is in her eyeball. The royal Ew. brand. Yeah. Yeah. Lucina's is in her eyeball. Yeah. 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 yeah, it's really like, how did, they, how did that happen? Yeah. That's it's, a real question. It's because they're like, they're blessed by the it's gods. You know what it is. They didn't want to have to animate it on every model. I mean, like, blessed by the gods. Well, Mark doesn't have it. No, that's what I'm saying. Lucinus is not her eyeball, well, like, so they didn't have to I do like a different extra continent. weird. <laughs> like I can roll her from different, like completely different continents. I think. I'm not sure, but real, it's putting in that work right now. He's got that damage up. Oh, oh. oh. he he tried oh, yeah. it. I would have been so mad, honestly. Like if that had worked, I might have like. <laughs> Let's go! Wow. What do you do about that down tilt? You're, <laughs> you're, in, a, so you're in a tech situation and you get down tilted by Calm. <laughs> what do you do? Any I'm trying you, not to be. Any way, no, no, any way you tech, so you so are going to get go. hit. Let's go, Sal. Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Like, Grail can definitely do this. It's not I looking impossible. It's not even looking hard, funny, realistically. Yeah. But yeah, we're all like, like talking it, about like this is the first time I've seen it. It's like, just like there's just a, a couple like, little things like, that he keeps tripping up on out of, of shield or like, like yeah. on shield. He, like it's just bad spacing yeah. sometimes that keeps tripping him up on these crucial moments. I mean, Bray's yeah. calling down the south right now. I'm 
It's interesting that you have to play differently for Tom. Well, or, yeah, because with Roy. Roy, it's a lot more... You can be in his face, but you have to get out of his face. Yeah. You have to be in and out with prompt. It's like, you have to stay in his face. If you give him space, he will hit you, because his entire sword hits the same. So, what do you do if you're brave, right? You're like, oh, he's the, he takes the glass cannon. Yeah. I gotta play Pikachu now, like... But how does that conversation I'm go? honestly surprised he hasn't went to Sheik because he beat well, Brody's Crown with Sheik. Yeah, I think yeah. the, if he goes to Sheik, right, the thought process is he drops game one yeah, and Crown beats you, and then it becomes Sheik Roy, and then back to Crown beat you. Looks like he's doing it. Like, no, he evened it up with Pichu. Yeah. Like what? <laughs> no, he's oh, no. <laughs> oh, it's a thing. <laughs> Yeah, the, the audio. I tried using the headphones and like I couldn't hear the characters. Yeah, that's an issue. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do. Uh, play with the stuff. Oh, all right, yeah. The jab okay, reset. I respect that. This this could be it. Oh yeah. yeah. F to, uh, to. All right. So that's it. Vrail got it. Game three. Uh, he made the adaptation. You know, he just. Like, what it came down to was just he was able to keep his advantage a lot more. I think because it's not a character he might be that familiar with, he yeah. keeps letting Brody slip That's okay, though. out of disadvantage state with those air dodges or up Bs because he does not want to get hit and he's not sure if he's going to get hit or not. So he just kind of drops the whole situation after a combo. Whereas, uh, like, if you had seen his set against Nova, he was more, like, okay with continuing yeah. his extensions yeah. and being like, okay, I'm going to read this and that. Uh, also, no, he, he's, you know, you know, he's kind of jumping, drifting back in yeah. the air to read that to keep Brody out. Yeah, yeah definitely. Uh, I will say, though, I think it's very strange that um, when Brody willingly goes full screen, Rail is not doing uh, Thunder Drifts. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure why that might be. Maybe he doesn't want to get ran up on, which, you know, that's fair. Like, I wouldn't yeah, get ran up on Blackcom either. He's kind of <laughs> But, like, uh, against his Roy in set one for the earlier games, a lot of what he was doing was. Oh my god! Scoop! Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> that was nuts. <laughs> But it's that didn't even two frame it scoop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. scoop him, dude. That's yeah. actually that was like crazy. Some wolf up smash. <laughs> okay, but like when you look at where his jab starts, it makes sense. Like it starts like yeah. basically under. <laughs> Imagine just holding your sword like this. Uh, no, I can't. But that's why he's doing so. Yeah, that's why he's doing so good. He's just he's putting it there. Oh, yeah. he's part of their. Um, Okay, um, Rail's probably not gonna... I don't know, he's gonna make a lot of things happen. A lot of things just turned into one combo, but... He's dead. Brody's so good at that. Fucking... That shit is so good. When you... Like, it literally makes it to where you have to be... You're shook for your life, it's 60%. You're at 60%, you're like, I'm about to die. Rail is kind of running away with this stock right now, though. He doesn't take too much more percent, you know. He's going. Oh, yeah, he's going, like, he's... Look, when you're down a whole stock, right, and you just got reset in bracket, you have to start making those plays. You have to start being like, okay, I'm going to actually move out of shield now. I'm going to start trying to punish him actively for these things. And, like, sometimes it doesn't work out. Like, there's been a couple of stocks where, like, him trying his best to do like whatever mm. has gotten him hit uh like he gets hit out of his dash so often and i think like even if the thunder jolt was out in front of him just to force the shield it would be a lot better oh that, there you go that startup armor all right one one more and also one more stop one more combo is all it takes for Braille to be able to bring this to This is really important. Is this game three? It's game three, so this is really important. Yeah, yeah. This, this is make or break moment, honestly. Because if you, even, if you lose, yeah. even if you lose game four, you get the counter pick. Yeah. Dude, Braille with these neutral get-ups in the last set situation. It's very bad. Like, And Pichu's not a character that can typically get 
like usually Pichu can get away with that because mm -hmm. people are more concerned about trying to cover the jump from yeah. Thunder Jolt. But I would like to start seeing him do jump Thunder Jolt more often. Um, can can Pichu uh, be like go through like Pikachu's? Is it different anyway? Uh, it goes through really people. Good. It goes farther, but it does not have a hit. Okay, so it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't do any damage yeah. or, like, or any stun or anything. So like it's worse for trying to challenge people unless you're just like completely sure that they're going this way. And you're trying to go. Uh, but like, dude, Brody's execution with this character is like very good. I, he's gotten better as the sets have gone on. Dude. Oh yeah, definitely. Like, he's starting to be like, all right, I, I want um jab to down to Not really. Okay, he just grabbed but, <laughs> gra grab to nothing, but he's got that damn that just did like forty percent damn here. So strong. Oh yeah. Dude, that down tilt puts you in a tech situation so early. He was at like yeah, 50. Right. I mean, you think what you want. I don't care. Uh, well, the, uh, the it's, are really weird. Uh, again, like, it's very, like, kind of awkward that, like, Grail he just dared. is, yeah, <laughs> it almost killed him. <laughs> That's the saddest part. Like, he's not abusing the Thunder Jolt neutral. He has his long, yeah. he has a super long stage, but. I would imagine it'd be so hard for Prime to do with it, too. The Jolts. Yeah, it, it's kind of like how with Roy, like, he wasn't really able to yeah. get what he needed. I want to finish Do you think uh, any, any of it could be he doesn't want to add a percent to himself? Like Maybe. Because I'm Crom Kill is so powerful. Yeah, so I don't like know weird, if it would be that big of a deal. Honestly, yeah, that's good. I think I'm it's really more happy. like uh, Grail is just like afraid. <laughs> like he's not as confident doing. Uh, you say that though, but he's up a whole stock. Oh, I'm just, hey. <laughs> like he he got he cut him off the ledge. But like in neutral, like he's not. He's trying to play up close. He's trying to play in his face. But like he's not doing the thunder jolts first to keep that momentum, to keep that to make sure that Brody's either shielding or already pressing the button. I like Lancer. He does a lot of cool animation in their armor like That's how I wanted to vote. But yeah, like this is this is where Vera wants to be. Yes. He's up out of stock. Brody has gotta come to him. <laughs> and you know, Brody, you know, to like his, his credit, he like could definitely do this. Yeah. Like completely. Dude, like one jab. Uh, one down tilt would not be good. I just kept it. These neutral getups are just... Neutral getup. Neutral getup is the word of the day. Actually, what? What? What is the set count for winner's finals? Let's go, Brody! What's the set count for winner's finals? 3-2. Game 14. Oh, I see what you're saying. I was so confused for a second. Right. Dude, Brody with the adaptations, I do want to say, like, coming from Winners Finals to this set, it's yeah. like they're a completely different player. For sure. Um, he do do that. I'm pissed. He needs time. Like, that's why I was going to say, like, losing the two out of three, because, like, if it's a three out of five, he typically clutch. Game five, though. Brody hey, but like, you know, like I'm, I'm singing all these praises of Lord Brody, but fucking beat me in tournament. <laughs> all right, so they're going to Battlefield. Um, last time they went to Battlefield. For what Bro happened? <laughs> Brody won. Um, I'm so like, I'm not really sure about letting. I, why would you ban if not Triflats against Swords? Oh my god. I think he's like. <laughs> yeah, he's going like if he gets F tilted or like jabbed near the ledge, he will. He's, he's, yeah, it's over. No, <laughs> not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Back here. Here. Uh, F L oh, F jab. Oh. No. <laughs> I mean, there. Real thing proposed. And I, hmm, this definitely is better than the Roy pick because. With Roy, um, he would whiff, and like, mm -hmm. since he would have to be up close to get the sweet spots, uh, like, Grail, Grail could afford to, like, move out of shield, he could narrow out of shield, jump out of shield, because he'd be so close to him. But now, it's just... Are you just trying to get off the ledge right now? Wow. I told you that. 
the, the lens trapping for both of these characters. You said he's a kill percent like 60% percent ago. <laughs> oh, he's dead back here. Yeah, uh, I'm not really sure what he did with that uh, up B. He, was, he landed like right on top of 40. Maybe he was thinking he would mix Brody up, but he was just kind of ready for it. Yeah. Like Brody's reaction is like definitely yeah, he's, he's ready. Bro got a sizable percent. Okay. Yeah, I think this, this really just turned into a game of like who who has the lead first because both of them are so good at holding their banner seats that like getting hit. You're not gonna stop getting hit. You're at ledge. You're dead. No. <laughs> And he just kind of stick his foot out, and as he's coming up, he gets like oh, kicking his foot. <laughs> oh, he tried. Uh, I think. No, nah, the DI. Yeah, uh, yeah. Was there. he couldn't have got that. Oh my god! Back air, caught him jumping up air, back air, and tangible up okay, air, man. How is he supposed to land? He can't. Ah. Oh, he might die for this. No. Yeah, he's yeah he's dead. <laughs> Let's Never go! Oh, oh, <laughs> All right, guys, you know game ten. You know this is definitely not impossible. Let's go, Brody. It's not impossible. It's definitely possible. <laughs> oh, oh, he's dead! Yeah. Wow! Wow! Set. What an anticlimactic end to such a nice, good the set. Frail taking it 3-2 after a Game 5 reset. Pichu boys.